Hi, it's Andrea. How is everybody doing? Um, I wanted to come on today and have a chat to you uh, about your cycle and how you can achieve more by following your natural rhythm of your menstrual cycle every day. So for anybody that doesn't know me, I'm Andrea and I'm a nutritional therapist and I love to help women and support women to get healthy hormones so they can look good and feel good inside and out. And today in my video, I want to talk to you about your cycle and how you can work with your monthly cycle to get more done and to achieve more and to feel more and feel more fulfilled with your life and feel a lot happier with your life. Um, because I speak to a lot of women that feel like stressed out, lots of PMS symptoms and feel like they're not getting anywhere, they're doing lots of things and it's not fulfilling them at all. They don't feel like they're fulfilled in their life anymore. And is this you? Are you feeling unfulfilled in your life? You feel like you just, you, you push, push, push all the time, wanting to get lots of things done. And you just don't seem to be getting anywhere or even you're pushing yourself, even though you're not, your body's telling you to slow down and take a break and don't put so much pressure on yourself because there are times of the month where you can be more productive and times of the month where you just need to stop, you need to slow down and you need to take yourself, you know, take better care of yourself. Um, so a lot of us, we want to please everybody, um, panic, panicking because you're not getting anything done and not really getting in tune with your body and saying no more. Um, especially at that right time of the month where you need more rest and repair. You shouldn't push, 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 because that then can lead to your putting you out of sync of your natural rhythm, and then you can have lots of symptoms, lots of PMS um, as well. It can be a, a massive difference um, because you have a different body every week of the month. Which is, makes sense, really, when you think about it, because I didn't really think about much, which you don't really do. You just know you have your period. You don't know much about which hormone is, is high in one week and where, where your hormones are in every week of your cycle. It does make sense you think about it. You're like, one week you're having your period, and then you come out of that, you finish again, and then estrogen starts to rise again, and then your ovaries prepare the egg again to be matured. And, and then to be released, and, and then progesterone is, is, um, goes high, then both fall again, then you have another period again. So, you know, there's different hormones around in, in different weeks of your cycle, so it does make sense to, to learn how to work with your body's natural rhythm, when to say no, when, to, when you're more productive, when you can get more things done, when your energy is higher. Are your temperature different? Uh, differentiates you each month as well. Um, that makes a big difference. Um, though th there are ways to restructure your life based around which week of the month you're in, and, and when you align with that rhythm, you will have less stress, less exhaustion, less PMS symptoms. You're going to get more done because you know which week of the month you can be more productive, and so you're going to you're going to target that week, those weeks where you can get stuff done um, more effectively. Um, we're all hormonally, more hormonally sensitive nowadays, I think, because there's more, um, we've got more blue lights, we have more toxins, we have more pollution, more cars on the road. So there's a lot of things that can disrupt our normal cycle and our normal, normal rhythm as well. We've got more to deal with now, more stress in our lives. So, um, they know that you need to, need to learn how to nourish yourself, how to work with your natural cycle so you can achieve more what you want. You're not working too hard, you're not pushing too hard, you're not pushing yourself all the time. So you need to know when, when each week of your cycle to, to take the best advantage for yourself. So your brain's not wired the same each week. So you can go through your to-do list and then you know, like I say, you know what, what to do to get more done. So don't make life hard for yourself. And your metabolism as well is also different during your cycle as well. 
So your exercise is, is a big one. So, and, and what you're eating during your cycle can make a big difference in different parts of your month. Um, you just need to change up your, the way that you exercise and when to rest and when you can do lots of high impact exercises. So if you're not in sync with your cycle, you may not be getting the results that you want. Um, and this can, that's, I say this can create a lot of period problems, PMS, because um, we are conditioned to help, we're conditioned to go, 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 cook, clean, work, shop, please everybody, keep everyone happy. And so do you find it hard to say no? So let me know in the comments below if you find it hard to say no to people and give more time to you, have more self-care and take better care of yourself, especially during a certain type, but certain parts of the month. When you need to say no, you need that, that you, you time to, to rest and repair. So how many of you as well are needing wine and or even coffee to perk you up? Or you needing to drink wine to help you relax or maybe to get you in the mood? You know, this is all stimulation. This is all, it's not getting in tune with you, not getting in tune with your body. You're needing something to, to help you to stop and relax. Whereas you can do that yourself. You don't need that stimulation. You don't need that caffeine to give you a, a buzz, a perk. So you can learn to say no. And because it's going to affect every part of your body and you're not going to be um, achieving success that way. Um, you're going to have health, healthy, health and prosperity and happiness and more fulfillment in your life. There's so many women now suffering from hormonal problems and it's not acceptable anymore for women to suffer like this. Um, so when you follow your natural rhythm, you're not fighting it. You're going with it. You'll have more success in every area of your life. It can be a massive game changer. So I put together my hormone reset, which has all this information that helps and supports you during your natural cycle, your natural rhythm. You know, when to exercise, when to rest, what type of exercise to do, um, what to eat to be more effective with your diet, and uh, when, when you can use intermittent fasting to your advantage, where, how you can do carb cycling to your advantage to keep your metabolism high uh, and burning more fat so you can maintain your weight and you can be more productive. So I put this hormone reset together which is everything that I've learned over the last 10 years to help me during my perimenopause journey and my hormone dysregulation and, and find out what works for women, how women's hormones work, because they're totally different from a man's. And I'm starting another hormone reset in August. So if you want to jump on board, um, you need to be quick because I've only, can only take space, I've only got enough space for so many women. So if you want to jump on board, I'm going to put the link um, in, the, uh, in the comments below where you can find more details and sign up. I'm going to be putting together a free meal guide over the, over the next um, coming week. So if you want to look out for that, this will contain rest some recipes that are in my hormone reset. So I want to give you this free so you can have a, a taster of what um, is actually in the meal guide, in the meal plan. Um, if you want to ask me questions about the type of food that you'll be eating, um, it's really easy to prepare. It's, it's not complicated at all because I don't like to spend hours in the kitchen either. You know, I want something quick and easy that's nutritious, it's healthy, and it supports your hormones. Um, so come and jump, jump on, and I'd love to see you. Um, we're in a private Facebook group as well, so you can come in there, and I do Facebook Lives in there once a week. It's a four-week um, hormone course, and you can ask any question you want during that on that live video that I do in the fit private Facebook group. And there's other women there to help and support you as well. And you can post things in that private group um, and get more support from me there. So then it sets you off on the track to getting healthy hormones, and then you can continue this, and you can continue with the meal plan. And it's just amazing how much you can change what you're doing now because I didn't think I could change the way I was eating you know I was a sugar junkie like I said I was eating lots of foods lots of bread I love pasta with rich sauces and things like that um, and I still eat pasta but I don't eat the wheat pasta 
Um, I still make healthy creamy sauces, but I don't make it with dairy. And um, so there are alternatives that you can that you can make to um, the foods that are not ideal for women's hormones as they get in, in the 40s, as you get into menopause. You just have to change a few things. And I really like the way that I eat now um, through this plan that I put together and this, this way of eating. Um, it's just so nutritious and it, it tastes absolutely amazing. Um, otherwise, I wouldn't eat it because I like food to taste good as well. And I still eat chocolate cake. Um, so, yeah, so if you, I'll put the comment in the a link in the comments below where you can sign up and find more details. So thanks for watching today. Um, if you've got any questions at all, um, please ask away. I'm happy to answer them for you. Um, so thanks for watching and I'll see you again in another video. Take care. See you later.